All right, guys, I'm back. Well, the O2 sensor came in a little bit faster than I, well, faster than I expected in the mail. Um, so, well, this is the no, new O2 sensor. So, yeah. And then, um, basically, I've already unclipped it and kind of loosened it. So, that's the clip I undid. And there's where it goes in at. So, um, pretty much I already have it a little bit loosened. Just so you wouldn't have to hear me fuss and complain at it and swear at it. So, um, uh, so yeah, I just gotta loosen it up a little bit more to get undone finger tight. So, um, but I kind of wish I had, they had that socket for it online, but, uh, you know, basic how house tools work. I'm just using a crescent wrench. Um, you can also use WD-40 on this stuff to loosen it up, depending on how long it's been in there. Um, I'm kind of surprised with mine never being changed out from the looks of it and having 200k on it that I didn't need to use some WD-40 to loosen it up but anyway as you can tell I have a transmission leak um, yeah I'm planning on doing a transmission pan drop and filter change so anyways there's the old one. As you can tell, it has a lot of carbon buildup on it. And then, wires were frayed. You can see a couple burnt wires in there. So, and then, we just go ahead and put the new one in. It's right there, there it is. Okay. Um, I'll show you where to plug it in first. So, yeah. Right up here by the transmission is a little plug for it. Right about there. See if I can get a light on for y'all. Uh, nope. Um, but it's just right here by the pan. I don't know if you can actually see it. But yeah dang things just right about there if you can see my finger right here so just straight up from where you can see it in a little dark area um, just clip this in real quick bear with me And for a little helpful tip, if you go to do this, make sure your car's been sitting for a while. Especially when it's right by the transmission, because the transmission, well, my transmission right now is very hot. So. But anyways. Oh. Uh -uh. Oh my gosh. As you can probably hear, my niece is hurting her mom in the background just playing with her.
Sorry guys. Um, I'll do that part a little bit later. But yeah, it's just a simple clip-in. Nothing too fancy. Um, and you just put the center right back in where you got the old one. Um, like so. And yeah. So. But yeah, so you guys kind of, you get the idea. I'll let you go while I fight with this monkey butt and keep getting burnt. So like I said, make sure you let it sit down, cool off longer than an hour. I thought an hour would be long enough to let the pen cool off, but it wasn't, so catch you next time.